guys, it's Darlene and welcome to my channel. All right, so today we are going to talk about how I created this five minutes, no more than five minutes, hair style. Very, very simple, elegant, but you look pulled together and it takes no time at all. So without further ado, let's jump right in. <laughs> I just recently did a video on uh, getting ready with me. We did the face. Now we are gonna uh, tackle this hair. So, truth be told, my hair is filthy. Um, not super filthy, but you know, I was supposed to get it done at the hairdressers today and she had an emergency. So I really didn't have time or feel like washing it. So what do I do? So my hair has been up, so it's kind of crazy, and then it's straight down here. First thing, I'm gonna take some dry shampoo, and this is not your mother's beach, babe. Texturizing shampoo, I love this. First of all, it has a nice fragrance to it, and I'm just going to spray it through my hair. And then I'm gonna take a wet brush, now it looks good, doesn't it? And just kind of comb through that, or brush through that. It is super hot, so I think what I'm gonna do is wear it up, and I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna do a top knot and then a back bun, if you will. So what I'm gonna do is start with the top knot. So I'm just gonna pull. The hair away from my face. And I'm gonna take a, a dark colored rubber band. And I'm going to put it in a ponytail. So then I'm gonna take that part that I made a ponytail and I'm just gonna wrap it around. And then what I'm gonna do is take some bobby pins and I'm going to, it's a little hard for me to look in the mirror, in the monitor, so there's a mirror behind me. And then I'm just gonna take a couple of them. Um, one on each side and one behind. Then what I'm gonna do is kind of pull at it because I don't want it, I want it to be kind of big and cute, and there you go. Then I'm gonna take the front and just pull it out a little bit, as so. So this is a top knot or my version of it. Now I would normally just straighten my hair. We are going to um, pull the back, pull the rest of it up. So we're gonna take the sides I'm gonna go ahead and make a ponytail. Okay, so I'm gonna turn around. So I, I did one loop, and then when I do go to do this second loop, I'm not gonna pull it all the way through. I'm just gonna pull it like this, okay? So it kind of looks crazy at the moment, but what I'm gonna do is take some bobby pins. This is super fast way of doing a really cute style. And I'm just gonna take and put a couple of, show you from behind. Hope you guys can see, can you guys see? So we don't. All right, so then I kind of pull it out again because I don't want it to be like so perfect, perfect. Um, I pull little strands down and then I take my fingernails and I kind of run across the baby hairs of my face and my forehead. And all that does is sort of pull out the little baby hairs and soften what's going on. Now, you see I have some of this crazy right here, so we're going to go ahead and just pin that part down. And that's just pulling pieces out. I don't like it too flat against, you know, my head. And then, like I said, I kind of use the fingers to kind of get those little baby hairs. See how the little baby hairs just start framing your face? At this point, we sort of have a separation between top knot and button. So what we're going to do is take this one and pull it forward just a tiny bit and just add a couple bobby pins in there to kind of just blend the two together. 
but we don't want to lose our volume. So now we have our pretty little do. It's, you know, you can pull it as much as you want if you like it a little bit bigger in the front. I'm all about big hair. I live in Texas, people. Um, <laughs> I just heated up my flat iron because these are super straight. My beautiful little uh, side pieces here. So I'm going to give them just a little bit of a twist. If you have your curling iron plugged in, I just, I still haven't unpacked mine from. wispy little curls. Play with it until I'm happy. <laughs> I'll take a little hairspray. I'm, oh my gosh, my hairdresser just got this in. This is the Redken Triple Dry. This is a hold of 15. They have stronger ones and I think they might have less strong ones. She knows I can't stand hard um, shampoo, uh, hard hairsprays. And this is a beautiful texture. And what I love about it is it smells divine. Like seriously guys, so good. So let me just make sure we have all the little hairs that I want down. I, I really like, and then I'll just kind of, so I just take with my finger and kind of just bring a few little wispies down around the face. And then what I'll do is just give it a little spray. And then you can just, you know, push down those little, and then just give it a nice little spray. And I think it's so cute. So let me show you. The other side. And again, it's not supposed to be slicked back or perfect or anything like that. I kind of want it free flowing and just kind of romantic. So now I'm going to get dressed and I'll be right back. Was that not the simplest hairdo ever? And I think it's super cute and a lot of fun. Um, you can wear it a multitude of ways if you just want to do that top knot and then straighten it. You've seen me do that in many, many videos. So um, that is very cute as well. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And, and as always, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will talk to you very soon. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful evening. Bye guys.